if you have not like and subscribe the channel please like and subscribe the channel you can uh, so that you will learn uh, something about Microsoft Intune and you want to become expert on Microsoft Intune in this video I'm going to say you how you can update or create a policy for iOS iPad iPhone devices how you can push the OS updates to company Apple iOS devices this is very easy but your devices must be supervised supervised means I have already made video on what is supervision means how you can supervise the devices through AVM or Apple configurator there is only two way and once your device is supervised and enroll into Intune then you can force update through the policy so the devices will silently get updated to the latest operating system so you have to go to the devices and click on iOS since we are talking about iOS and you see here the update policy for iOS let's create a new policy and this is update iOS devices right and it's mandatory right because because if you are managing company corporate on mobile devices then you must be thinking how you can patch those devices so that uh, that those devices company devices should be running on latest operating system like like for windows we are doing right the feature update windows update quality update security updates right similar like ios and android devices is like similar like endpoints now so you may be wondering how you can patch those devices as soon as apple releasing because nowadays apple releases many minor uh, patches very frequently so how you can do that update ios devices so you can give any name and and it will be supervised only right because you will not be able to uh, push the os updates on non-supervised devices or non so here you see here the create a profile that force assigned devices assign devices to automatically install the latest ios updates these settings determine how and when software update deploy this profile doesn't prevent user from updating the os manually so this profile will not prevent any ios users to updating the os manually whenever they want to update they can do it right which can be prevented for up to 90 days with the device configuration restrictions policy we can prevent it but only for 90 days through the device but we have to apply the device restrictions policy and update will only apply to the supervised devices okay if you don't know what is supervised devices just go and watch the video and understand what is supervised devices on my channel and how you can supervise the devices through apple configurator or apple business manager over there right so here you want to select the version of ios to to install on devices at a time now apple has made two different version one for iphone and one for ipad you already know so either you can select latest update whenever the apple will release the update will get pushed whichever the release currently you see as of today 16.3.1 is available right if apple will release 16.3.2 and you want to push that you can select always latest update so if you want to if you seeing some bug in 16.3 or 16.3 right you can select 16.2 or even lower so whatever so it's available starting from 12.5.6 12.5.7 because it's available for iPhone 6s so let's say we found a bug in 16.3 let's say I'm assuming and you want to push 16.3 only not the 3.1 okay or you want maybe you want to push 16.2 right let's select 16.2 it's depend on your how you gonna configure this update policy schedule the schedule type by default when the update policy is assigned to the devices by default 
Intune deploy the latest update at the device check-in. Okay. If you can instead create a weekly schedule with customized start and end them. So if you select update at next second by default when update policy will this policy will get assigned to the devices or apply in tune to apply the latest update to the device check in at the device second as soon as the devices will check in if you choose to update outside the schedule time in tune won't deploy update until the schedule time ends so you see there is three options update at next second update during schedule time update outside the schedule time so we want to of course select this schedule time you can select the utc time zone as per your wish right i am selecting 3 30 right and the start date you can select sunday saturday or whenever user want to friday let's be friday start time should be like uh 4 pm or if it's sunday let's say it's lunch time during 12 pm okay and time will be monday or saturday right and time you can give it as per your use whatever you want to do right so start time so during this time the until start we will start from friday 12 pm and time saturday 3 pm the update will push to those devices during this time if you want to apply to the groups selected groups all or users all devices select it if you want to exclude someone you can exclude it and create this policy try this method as soon as this policy will get applied to your devices it will get pushed to your devices but make sure that there is prerequisites your devices must be supervised i hope you will learn how you can push the updates to your ios devices try this method thank you have a good day signing off